In this game, we're going to be taking a look at an example of why it is helpful to keep an eye on the respawn timer of your jungle camps as you're jungling. We are playing Master Yi against a Dr. Mundo and we are going to take a control ward as part of our opening and place it in the brush near the topside river. Our bottom lane starts feeding well ahead of schedule as our Seraphine dies to an invade that Ray Charles could have seen coming. Understanding that this is going to be a very long game, we start a power farming route starting at our wolf camp intending to clear out our blue side jungle. As we're clearing the blue buff, our bottom lane dies again before the 2 minute mark putting them on a trajectory for 1 death per minute. Recognizing that we need to take action before this game spirals out of control, we're going to take the red buff and then hang around the bottom side jungle to watch for the next skirmish. During the next fight on the bottom lane, we make our move taking down the enemy pike and Tristana in exchange for our Seraphine. You always need to keep in mind that when you show up in a lane as a jungler that incentivizes any good enemy jungler to make a move elsewhere on the map. And sure enough, as we watch the topside river, we see that the enemy Dr. Mundo is coming into our jungle. The wolf camp is about to respawn and we're too far away to stop Dr. Mundo from taking it so we're going to go ahead and clear our raptors. As we're clearing the raptors, we notice that the grop is about to respawn. Now there is a 50-50 chance that either Dr. Mundo took the wolves as a free camp and then ran out of our jungle, or if they got greedy, he might have gone for the Gromp as well, in which case he will still be inside our jungle. We go explore our topside jungle and we notice that the Gromp has been cleared, which means Dr. Mundo must be around. We pant outside the topside tribrush to not be seen. We turn around into the brush, find Dr. Mundo and kill him. This play was made possible by the vision that we had on the river along with keeping track of the respawn timer of our jungle camps. If you like the content of this channel, do subscribe by hitting the subscribe button as well as the little bell icon to be notified of all new videos that are coming out. If you want to support the channel directly and help keep things going, there are a number of options available. In the about section of the channel, there's a Patreon link that you can join to directly contribute towards the channel as well as the Streamlabs link. You can also join the channel through YouTube memberships, which will unlock a number of perks including shoutouts at the end of the videos, videos on topics that you specifically want to have covered, as well as gameplay reviews of games that you want to have reviewed to find out what you could have done differently. There's also a community tab that I've opened uh, for people that want to provide some input, for example, on how long you want the videos to be. And there's also a Discord channel that opened recently, so if you want to uh, drop by and say hi or just chat with other folks who are subscribed to the channel, you can drop in here. If you want to see more videos like the ones that you're seeing right now, you can go to the playlist section of the channel to see a playlist on strategies that you can use in your games examples of decision making in game, as well as full game and analysis. I highly recommend checking out all three of these if you want to learn more about the game and develop your macro capabilities.